We do not have government by the majority. Rather, we have government by the majority who participate. Come 25th February 2023, we all will be out in our wide range numbers to put out our vote in our various polling units. But before then, let's go hit the street as we just with Steve. We'll be right back to know what Nigerians are actually rooting for. Good day, sir. Yeah. Um, how are you doing, sir? I'm fine, sir. Sir, what's your name? My name is Chukuka Okite. Summer. Mr. Jato. Joseph. Well, the Chukuma Francis. This is Chukwe Meka Chiamaka. Okay, Mrs. Chiamaka, um, why are you possibly voting for, for, you know, we are in the era of election, not just election, but the presidential election. So, who are you voting for? Um, likely, I'm likely to vote Peter Obi. <laughs> well, I'm voting Peter Obi, Labour Party. What is it for Mr. Peter Obi? Yes, your question is uh, very direct. Yes, the election is is very dicey, but uh, we are looking at the candidate who can deliver this country from the economic situation we are in now. So currently, among the contestants, among all the presidential candidates, you see, there's one outstanding candidate. There's no two way about that, which is Mr. Peter Obi. Ah, na Peter Obi na. So I should take your card, na Peter Obi na. Oh, if that's na show bank, na show banker. Show banker, ha. Heaven and earth, Peter Obi. Heaven and earth. Peter Obi. So you have your PVC? Ah, yes now. And you will vote? Sure, banker. I will vote for Peter Obi. The Labour Party all the way? All the way. Why are you possibly voting for him? What competence did you see that is making you vote for him? Okay, Peter Obi, when he was a governor of Anambra State, former Anambra State, well, he did very well. He, he saved money for Anambra State. I don't the next predecessor to build an airport with that money. Peter has been a very good nice guy that's very economical as well. He can transform the economy. He's an industrialist. He can bring industries to the country. We don't need people to trans PDP uh, and APC. They are, they are out of stock. They're no longer they are not competent at all. Look at what they promised us, everything they fell us. We are buying our currency with our money. Buying our uh, that one is the most uh, bad of that nation. Looking at his antithesis, especially when he was the governor of uh, Anambra State perform very well and then look, apart from his uh in government, his personal character and integrity points to the fact that that's the kind of leader Nigeria is looking out for. I'm voting for him because I see a new Nigeria. I see a new country you know with him. And I believe that things will turn around for good. First of all is that it will be get better vision for this country. Better vision will benefit me. And even my generations come. Yes. And it's for everybody. So I would like my fellow citizens to go and vote for Peter B2. Since the election process is started, everybody has been hearing Peter B, Peter B, Peter B. And I think he has done a lot of things for Nigerians in the past, in his states. And some of the things he has said, maybe what will do for Nigeria and the rest of them. And his person, yeah, I think he's the best for Nigeria for now. I think he's, he's the man of the people. And I, I'm quite assured that he will be a deliverer for Nigeria this time around. Right, so you're with your PVC? Yes, you can see it. I have it in my pocket. <laughs> and you're so certain that you were yeah. so out to vote. Ah, he said, we have our yeah, pulling in it here. We'll come up, we'll be massive. Mm, we're not even taking any money. If you give us money, we'll eat your money and cost your money. But we'll vote for Peter. That is simple. Thing. Thank you so much for that. We've all heard what the amazing Nigerians have said, and by the special grace of God, a new Nigeria is possible. Kindly share, like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Stay safe, stay smart, bless your heart. Bye for now.